Let, oh, <laughs> another thing they dropped in here, and like I said, they leave it there for you to figure out later. Um, who was the, who was the lady they were at that restaurant with? You see, oh, the uh, that looked like you talking about when uh, Emmy they went to a restaurant. They were uh, she went to the mm -hmm. bathroom, and old girl was talking about like, oh man, she took a naked picture. Yeah, with, I, I think that was her home girl. That was just her partner. It looked like because that wasn't her sister. Yeah, that wasn't her sister. But, but they don't tell you what that third wish is. They don't. They keep on. They, they keep stretching it. They like they've stretched it a couple of times. Like when he asked her sister, Reese, like there's a recent episode. Like you know, I'm still trying to figure out what that third wish is. She was just like, I think you should know. And I'm like, well, just tell me then. Like, you know, <laughs> stop playing. <laughs> stop playing with me. <laughs> <laughs> so the friend at the table was just like um the the wish she thinks she has some it has something to do with her like looking possessed in a picture yeah because she said she's dead uh they they talk and i think that's something i appreciate it, it irritates me but i appreciate about this show they talk as if you should know already i don't know anything <laughs> no no I'm it's saying the way they, the way they say the line. <laughs> yeah. She was like, "Yeah, she what you know." She was, like, "I'm trying to explain to you." So the guy, the guy left the camera, and then she stripped naked, and then she walked from the camera. And the way she looked in the camera, but it's like when she says it, it's almost like, like you should be picking up on what she's saying. Yeah, that was hella weird too. Like, okay, that's your homegirl. Why are you diamond her out? Like, you pretty much told her. You pretty much Crazy. told her that she went out there and had a fling with some Norwegian cat. And he painted her naked or something, or he or she took a picture of his with his camera naked. I was like, "Oh man, hey, hey, <laughs> hey, 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 you just you just said something hmm. that I did not think about." Which part? You said she had a, a fling with a Norwegian cat. Yeah, the dude that uh, well, it's definitely he was a photographer, and she, I guess, why he stepped away, she took a picture with his uh camera or something like that. But the guy was, she definitely gave him the gave him the uh the cheeks. So what if that's not Apollo's son? Hmm. And what would that what would that mean if it's not um? Cool. Like, what would that mean if it's not? So if it's not his son and it's this Norwegian guy, because at some point we're going to figure out who what, what this picture is about, right? Or what she looks like in this picture at some point. Or maybe he might find the photographer, whatever, right? Um, mm. What would that mean um, if it's not his? I mean, if, first of all, the baby would be way lighter, but the movie magic. And funny what you're saying that. What if, what if Apollo's dad wasn't his dad? Because he wasn't light. He well, he didn't look like Apollo. Doesn't look mixed. When we first, me and my wife, the first episode we were watching it, we thought when they did the flashback that was her parents. So she's light. Mm -hmm. But then you find out that's his parent. Right. There's no way that he's mixed with white. No, at all, <laughs> at yeah. all. And then um, the whole Apollo angle, he's named Apollo because you can't name him Rocky because he ain't white. Remember the dad was like, yeah. they were, she was like, she was like, we're not naming him Rocky. And he was like, well, how about Apollo? You are now tuned into Black on Black Prime. Prime. Uh, disclaimer, no matter if we liked your movie, liked your show, or hated the show, or hated your movie, it doesn't matter. We respect you, shout outs to you, and we support you, and we try to get everybody else to support you like we support you. Black on Black Prime, we stand on what we say, though. And just like always, if you didn't ask for our opinion, we didn't ask you to listen to it. So, sorry. Click and turn it off. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I was going to, but then I just didn't. I got, it's coffee. I was going to though. I wanted to go off on the shot, uh, but we back though. This ain't the shot. Hey y'all, we back. Um, for a new a new show just dropped on Apple TV. Apple TV is killing the game, and they're gonna try to make me pay for that shit, and I don't want to. But it seemed like they got fired, so I gotta like find gotta, out what you got it for free. Mm hmm. Oh snap! That's what's up, man. You know. 
You gonna ask me some shit like that on here, right? <laughs> I mean, you was just like, man, as soon as they start charging, I'm just like, what you mean? Uh, no, I didn't say they start charging. I said I was going, uh, I don't want to pay for it. Oh, okay. Because gotcha. they, uh, cause they, it seemed like they dropping shit. Like they, they just dropping them. Yeah, they got some good little shows. It seemed like they, they, they're, if anything, I feel like they picky with what, what they put out. Because a lot of you know streaming services now, they just was like, y'all got a show? Mm-hmm. Come on, man, put that thing on there. What's it called? Oh, it don't even matter, bro. It's lit. <laughs> <laughs> it's up, nigga. We just gonna yeah. drop it on there and see what happens. Yeah, man. But it seemed like they got some shit. Like I gotta find out what I'm canceling to get that. I guess. But uh, the Changeling starring Lakeith and uh, what's the co-star? The lady's name. Uh, her name Emily or Emmy? I keep it like I see. I got the uh, captions on. It's just like I keep saying Emily, but on here so in the show. Yeah, is it Emmy or Emily? Honestly, I don't know. Okay, I don't feel like I, I don't feel like I heard enough of her name enough to know. Well, yeah, I mean she's played by a lady named Clark Bacco. I've mm. never heard of her. I've never heard of her before. What else she play in? I've seen her face before, for sure. Yeah, she looked familiar. Uh, hey, you know, I got in trouble for that movie review. Uh, my wife didn't watch the movie, but watched the review. So I was like... <laughs> Which one are you talking about? <laughs> Which one are you talking about? Uh, for uh, for uh, the wrong guy. Or the wrong one. What happened? She was like, yeah, I heard the review. And then she just stood there and stared at me. We was like, what? <laughs> like, yeah, I heard it. Oh, or what? <laughs> that's what you like. That's what you like. She was like, "It wasn't even that big." Oh my god! Like you wouldn't did research. You had, you had work doing research. <laughs> my wife don't. My wife don't watch the podcast. Um, you know, <laughs> you have to do some research. <laughs> have to binge watch these one day. <laughs> but uh, the, um, Clark Banco, she's played on the only one that I see that I know is The Handmaid's Tale. No, oh, I did not watch that, sir. I mean. I saw it. Yeah, I saw like maybe two episodes, and I was like, "Yeah, yo!" And she only played in one episode, so there you go. Yeah, oh, okay. She, she looked like familiar she, then. She just looked like somebody else, right? She looked. She was the main star of a show called Letter Kenny. She did like thirty-one episodes of that, but I never heard of that one either. Mm-mm. But anyway, but anyways, um, this is a a fairy tale. It's a fairy tale of a story because that's the the first episode. That's what he says. He says some some the, the narrator. He mm-hmm. said something about fairy tales, and he was like, "This one starts in the library in two thousand twenty-one or something like that." Two thousand twenty-one, yeah. I mean, it's <laughs> it's, it's very fantasy. Uh, yeah. it, it, so much so to where I'm like, I started like getting to this. I was, I was just like, "Yo, it's like, is what's going on really happening?" Because it was like dreams, and then he's like, "You would wake up, and then something crazy would happen." I'm just like, "Did that really happen, or is it just?" Am I, supposed I li- to, am I supposed to know these things? Uh, so we what, we're four episodes in right now because that's all they've dropped so far. And I literally think uh, I think I know what's going on. You think you know what's going on? Mm-hmm. Okay. It's funny. I waited till we got on here to tell you that. I, I got. I got. I got a prediction. I got a prediction. I'm not. I'm not anywhere close to being sure of what I think. But I just. I feel like I know what's going on. Hey, run that. That you want to say right now? Yeah, why not, man? You know, oh, my bad. Uh, <laughs> I feel like I feel like Apollo is dead, and so I feel like I know what you're gonna say. Can I say what you're gonna say? Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. Right. We here, nigga. You call me. I'm calling you on next side. Hold on, Chris. Um <laughs> <laughs> So, do you think that Apollo is like his son? And was and was killed. Well, was killed by his parents early on. Mm-mm. That's not that's not what you were thinking. I think I think Apollo died uh, that day. He stayed home uh, from work. Like you know, his mom kept doing that. What what was it like, like episode two? They were showing his mom would leave him every Saturday. Right. That's when his pops would pull up. Yeah. Yeah. So I feel like he did something and he started a fire in the house and, and died and the mom covered it up and threw him in that suitcase. Whoa. <laughs> yeah. You saw the suitcase Whoa. they threw in the water, right? Yeah. I thought that was just going to be his, I thought that was his pop stuff or whatever. No, nah, it's, it's, it's the, the, the significance of how she dumped it in the water. Cause if it was just her dad, his dad's stuff, she could have just 
threw that shit away. It's like, why sinking in the bottom of the water? Wow. But then also, I feel like the mom might have got uh, into that witchcraft shit and did some shit to bring him back. After the suitcase situation? Mm-hmm. Hmm. Because the mom is, the mom is, uh, she's from Africa, right? She's from somewhere. Yeah, she's from Africa. Uganda. Yeah, Uganda. So, um, just something, something, there's a weird vibe about her, too. Yeah. I mean, there's a weird vibe about everybody in the show pretty, so far. Pretty much. Pretty um, much. So, I mean, like what you said would be crazy, but mm. I'm just, th- I'm just thinking about everything he's done as an adult, right? Um, mm. All those things that we've seen, like him meeting Emma and then her, um, like what would what would she have to do with that? Like if the story was just about him, then I'll be just like, that's dope. That's a dope twist. But like, what is what would him meeting Emma have to uh, do think, with that? But but think about it. How how much have you seen Emma in this story? Well, I mean, they were just, they wiped her out. Uh, what was that second episode? I mean, she's still alive technically, but you know, she, they just uh-huh. they're just talking about her right now. Like she's not dead. Yeah, so I'm, I'm. What I'm saying is the main, the the majority of this show is focused on him. Yeah, like yeah. the all around majority of it. They, 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 they talk about Emma, but it's like um, she almost seems like the secondary character. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. At first, I thought of you know when when you see the trailer, you think it's going to be about them as a couple. You know what I mean? They're both going through mm-hmm. these uh th- these type of weird dreams and and these issues. I thought it was more going to be on a lo- the lines of that the strand that she had on, which is it kind of still is because they they be they they're dropping little hints. Like when I was looking yeah. at the you know the explained, like as I'm every episode, I'm like, huh. <laughs> <laughs> Huh? Um, I'm, I'm more so so like uh, like I think it's dope like because you told me before we got on here you telling me that they dropped these explains yeah me um I, I I more so like to figure it out on my own you know what I mean I feel like I feel like if I watch explain I'm gonna be mad because they're gonna say something like well that makes sense I I couldn't put that together myself well, the, I, it, the theories they you know what mm-hmm. I mean like people that are are giving the explain I don't think they know too much either but they are more uh they have more knowledge. It looks like they have done the research on mm-hmm. like the, the names of the people because then when they start talking about like Greek mythology and whatnot and, and these certain books, I've never read that and I'm not into right. Greek mythology. So it's like some of that stuff I have to look up in order to even it's going over my head. Yeah. You know what I mean, a, a, a lot of it is, too. It's, it's not. um It's not. So when we watched the preview, we did the review of the preview of the show. It did seem like a I don't want to say a uh simplistic show but it seemed like basic knowledge like yeah uh she went over here she made a deal with a witch and it's like they broke that deal now they curse it's like right. that's the that's what it seemed like basic but the way they putting these episodes together it's like you'll get a jump back scene over here you you'll get some stuff over here and they don't ever explain nothing they'll explain it later but they'll tell you about it now it's like we kept seeing uh when when uh apollo was a kid his dad would come to the door take off the mask and blow smoke Mm-hmm. And it'd be like that's it, and, and then they'll move on to something else. So it's like uh, they don't really explain on the spot, but mm-hmm. but then later on they might say some because like okay, so uh, for example, uh, and I'm just gonna jump to the fourth episode when they were on the boat and dude was like, uh, what's his name? What's Leon's name in here? Uh, Patrice. Patrice. When he was like, uh, he said, "Did you tell anybody else?" He was like, "I told Patrice." And the dude looked at him was like Patrice and he clicked on the profile. What what, what was going on with that? You said when he clicked on whose profile? When he clicked on um it was like a little oh, video, oh, uh, like uh, a little uh, Facebook or whatever, a little Facebook yeah, group. Yeah. I think it was a group about the it was like a tribute Facebook post or something like mm-hmm. that. And he said something. I think it looked like Patrice was on there posting. Like under, yeah. Yeah, under a different, like I don't know, another group name or something like that. But mm-hmm. I guess he kind of tripped out about that, like. That was that would be something I have to go back to. Like, why would he trip out on on that? You know what I mean? Is, that's what Patrice, I'm saying. So, is Patrice not his boy, or is he doing something? Yeah, like slick, that's, you know what I mean? that's what I'm saying. So, when they do little stuff like that, it's kind of like hold this. We'll talk about this later on. So it's like when they when they said that, and then he was like, and then he clicked on it. He was like, yeah. In this picture, it was a boat a boat sinking, and it but and Lakeith was just like. Shh. And he was like, yeah, man, you can't invite all vampires in your house. It was just like, what that have to do with anything? But I feel like 
they drop stuff here and then later on they will like we'll tell you yeah and i'm usually not even into them type of shows but it's mm-hmm. like it's only because i don't want to do the work <laughs> and now I'm, 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 I'm gonna keep it real with you. You know what I mean? Like I'm, I'm trying to be as real as I can be. No, you like, said that before. Yeah, you, I, you said I, I that like, before. I like stuff like this though. You know what I mean? It's just like, oh, this looks interesting, right? But I kind of want to get it, like mm. on that episode. You know what I mean? To where it's just like I got it myself, and if I did want to look at that, I just want to like verify. Versus right. like I watch something and I'm just like, I'm totally lost. Now I gotta go look at something else in order to get it. I don't want to do that. No, I remember you said that when we talked about um we talked about like briefly we talked about um tenant. You was like you said I I'm not I don't got time for that. You was like I, I don't <laughs> I don't got time to be sitting there trying to figure this shit. Out. I don't say I said, and it, and it makes me feel like okay, it's not that I'm not smart and 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 to pick up on some things. It's just certain things that I haven't read. Mm-hmm. I don't I you know what I mean? Like I don't have this knowledge yet, but I guess it's like it's what cuz this is a book, you know what I mean? Like this mm-hmm. has been written before. You know, what I mean, by the uh, the guy that's narrating. I think his name is uh, is Lavelle or something like that. Oh, the same guy who wrote it is narrating. Right, right, right. Oh, okay. So it's like, you know, should I have read the book? You know what I mean? Stuff yeah. like that. You know, things like that. Yeah, I, I feel you, but you know, w- with me, I like because I be so uh, so nosy. Like, I try to figure out whatever I'm watching. I like, like trying to figure it out before we even get halfway through the movie or halfway through the show. I like trying to piece the shit together. So I could be, I, I could be irritated if if it's one of those things where it's like you really got to know the knowledge. Like like I could be irritated with that, but in here it's like like I said, everything you have to pay attention to everything. Everything is a clue, even with the intros. There's a different text message every time the show comes on. It's like you you, you have to pay attention to every little thing that's going on, which I so it makes it. It's like putting a puzzle together, right? So I so. You can technically, if you wanted to, take this show for what it is, right? Like, you know what I mean? Say mm-hmm. if you just didn't catch on to nothing, you know what I mean? You kind of just mm-hmm. reca- recapping what happened, you know what I mean? Like, these are the things mm-hmm. that are happening, and you just take that for what it is. But in right. my mind, I'm looking at this like, okay, like, I don't I don't want to just do that. You know what I mean? <laughs> I don't, don't want to just be just like, okay, you met this woman. Okay, this is their family. This is the backstory of their family. Okay, this is what mm-hmm. happened. Now she's she beats the hell out of Apollo. She killed the bed. Like I don't want to just kind of go like I want to know why. And I yeah, think I think that's the 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 issue or whatever. But you know it. Um, I mean we we keep going. We we're jumping. You know what I mean? Right yeah. now we we just talking about the show. Uh, yeah, I mean we, we <laughs> yeah. it ain't like we could talk about it in order because everything yeah, yeah. is like exactly it's all over a, the place. it's crazy. So. Have you noticed? Um, because and, and this is and these are just something that I, I saw in more because I didn't even pick it up at first. So when I saw mm-hmm. them explain the first episode or whatever, it was like there's a lot of uh interracial uh, yeah. things, going everybody on. like everybody's like it's an interracial thing, and, and also the witch, like she was like black but with blue eyes and blonde hair, yeah. Or did you like you know what I mean catch like stuff like that? I'm just like, see, I would have never caught that. I would have been just like, oh, that's just. But with black so, so with blue that, eyes and blonde hair. <laughs> so with that, I saw. So when you say that, I saw that she had the blue eyes, blonde hair. But at that point, I'm just like, this is just a weird ass witch. Like the whole situation is weird. So I'm not even thinking, uh, thinking of it like that. Like, mm-hmm. uh, why does she have blue eyes, blonde hair? I'm like, this is just a weird ass witch. Like it's a weird ass lady. Right, and they they both have interracial parents. Mm-hmm. Both have is, fucked up parents' backgrounds. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Um, so it, it's it's just a lot of things like that. I'm trying to really reel in, and I'm just like, okay, let's put these pieces together. You know what I mean? Like, what what's the boat got to do with anything in the beginning? You know what I mean? Like, why did yeah. he on this boat? Mm-hmm. What the fuck does that have to do with anything going on right now? It's not even in the same like setting. Like even in even when you go backwards, like you know, with the mom and dad, like that looks like something. <laughs> back, 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 <laughs> that looks like something way far away. Like so, what does that have to do with anything? And then it's like these book titles, right? Like you know, to kill a mockingbird. Yeah, Why does this guy want to buy that book. Um, and- you know, but no, even before all of that, because To Kill a Mockingbird, I know it's a great book, but I don't remember it. Okay. I don't remember what happened in that book, and also, um, I feel like I, I just feel like, like it ties into what's going on, and that's it, the- it, it, it has to, it yeah. has to. But I'm not gonna go re re re-read the book. To see. 
<laughs> it definitely like. has to, though. So I feel you on that. Yeah. Uh, I, I also feel like they, um, so I feel like this, uh, it's like a poetic way to look at life sometimes with, with the shit they do. Like, uh, cause if you think about it, both of them, like, um, um, uh, Apollo and the, I can't think of the lady's name, but uh, they, they uh, both, Emma? yeah, they both have trauma from when they were kids, but mm -hmm. neither one of them remember how what really happened and it's like if you think about when you were little something might have happened back then in your mind you saw it a different way you remember it a different way till somebody mm -hmm. else tell you like nah you flew yeah. out that motherfucking car you'd be like what so right. it's like i feel like they they they're, they're showing what uh what the reality is of it compared to what you remember like like uh with what with, with those characters if i'm wrong about apollo being dead and this shit being wrapped around him mm -hmm. i feel like that they, they they do a lot of that poetic shit. Like, uh, they're having nightmares about something they don't even really remember. Yeah, uh, I get what you're saying because, like, even with um, Emmy or Emma, I, I swear I, I feel like I'm saying her name wrong. It's either Emily or Emmy because I'm looking at IMDb and it's like it's Emmy, but I keep saying Emily on the show, so they know what I'm talking yeah. about. Yeah. Um, apparently, like, she remembers something a different way when she was talking to her sister about like you know the house burning down like didn't she remember mm -hmm. that a different mm -hmm. way and her sister remembers it a different way yeah it, she remembered it like uh because she was like she was sitting on the couch and her mom was doing her hair and the sister was like nah she was doing my hair right yeah and then it's like and then it's like she explained the whole story because she was like uh dad she said daddy ran away or something like that and she mm -hmm. was just like nah he walked back in that fire right ain't that weird she, that she was twisted yeah ain't that weird like that how like Things could be like that. Like we could be telling somebody, like you know, I'm telling you my life story. I'm like, oh yeah, man, when I was eight, whoop de whoop happened. But that might not even happen to me. It just that could have been a dream. That could have been what I wanted to happen. <laughs> yeah, it, 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 is, it is literally like that. Like um, it, it's like people you you can't. There's no way to actually say factually this is what happened from from a memory. Yeah, like I tell a uh, 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 you know, Minister Society, my favorite movie. Mm -hmm. But my mom and my brother swore up and down it was juice. And I'm just like, I can't argue with you guys because you're not going to tell me what I remember. You know what I mean? Like, the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> but they just back and forth with me. No, it was juice. Like, okay. Yeah. Because okay. I, I, okay. But it's like, it's, it, you can't, you, especially at the ages they were, they were little, little. Right. Yeah. So they only remember what they remembered. Yeah, and, and it could be a total lie. You know what I mean? It's just like this is the mm -hmm. way that you. This is the way you remember it. But like you know, if you talking about like, oh yeah, daddy ran away. Like that's big. Like daddy ran away. Like no, nah, mm -hmm. daddy went into the fire. Like that's big. That means you could have hated your father your whole life thinking he ran away, but he was yeah. he went to go save your mom. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't go say he didn't go to save the mom. Well, he no. went and he went back into the house. Is what I mean. Because mama was yeah. the mama, did the mama die already in the house because she was in there just chilling. Because the mom was it. crazy. Right now, yeah. So she, uh, so I, I believe she's like, I'm about to die. Like this is, I'm about to, I'm about to kill myself, and I want to kill my family too. So did the dad go back in the house to kill himself too? That's what it looked like. Mm. That's what it looked like to me, because the way he stopped and stared at them before he went in. That's yeah. what it looked like to me. I so it, it, it very well could have been he went there to save her, but it looked like to me like he was like, I'm about to just go die with her. And when I tell you them niggas was bacon burnt. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> let, oh, another thing they dropped in here and like i said they leave it there for you to figure out later um who was the, who was the lady they were at that restaurant with you see, oh the uh that looked like you talking about when uh, emmy they went to a restaurant they were uh she went to the mm -hmm. bathroom and old girl was talking about like oh man she took a naked picture yeah with, I, I think that was her home girl that was just her partner it looked like because that wasn't her sister yeah that wasn't her sister but they don't tell you what that third wish is they don't they keep on they, they keep stretching it they like they've stretched it a couple of times like when he asked her sister Reese, like there's a recent episode like you know i'm still trying to figure out what that third wish is she was just like i think you should know and i'm like well just tell me then like yeah <laughs> stop playing <laughs> stop playing with me <laughs> <laughs> so the friend at the table was just like um the the wish she thinks she has some it has something to do with her like looking possessed in a picture yeah because she said she's that uh they they talk 
And I think that's something I appreciate. It, it irritates me, but I appreciate about this show. They talk as if you should know already. I don't know anything. <laughs> no, no. I'm saying not the way they, the way they say the line. <laughs> yeah. She was like, "Yeah, she what you know." She was like, "I'm trying to explain to you." So the guy, the guy left the camera, and then she stripped naked, and then she walked from the camera. And the way she looked in the camera, but it's like when she says it, it's almost like, like you should be picking up on what she's saying. Yeah, that was hella weird too. Like, okay, that's your homegirl. Why are you diamond her out? Like, you pretty much told her. You pretty much Crazy. told her that she went out there and had a fling with some Norwegian cat. And he painted her naked or something, or he or she took a picture of his with his camera naked. I was like, "Oh man, hey, 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 you just you just said something <laughs> that I did not think about." Which part? You said she had a, a fling with a Norwegian cat. Yeah, the dude that uh, well, it's definitely he was a photographer, and she, I guess, why he stepped away, she took a picture with his uh camera or something like that. But the guy was, she definitely gave him the gave him the uh the cheeks. So what if that's not Apollo's son? Hmm. And what would that what would that mean if it's not um? Cool. Like, what would that mean if it's not? So if it's not his son and it's this Norwegian guy, because at some point we're going to figure out who what, what this picture is about, right? Or what she looks like in this picture at some point. Or maybe he might find the photographer, whatever, right? Um, mm. What would that mean um, if it's not his? I mean, if, first of all, the baby would be way lighter, but the movie magic. And funny what you're saying that. What if, what if Apollo's dad wasn't his dad? Because he wasn't light. He well, he didn't look like Apollo. Doesn't look mixed. When we first, me and my wife, the first episode we were watching it, we thought when they did the flashback that was her parents. So she's light. Same. Mm -hmm. But then you find out that's his parent. Right. There's no way that he's mixed with white. No, at all, <laughs> at yeah. all. And then um, the whole Apollo angle, he's named Apollo because you can't name him Rocky because he ain't white. Remember the dad was like, yeah. they were, she was like, she was like, we're not naming him Rocky. And he was like, well, how about Apollo? Man. <laughs> If I sit down here all right, and think about all of these things, like this ain't even <laughs> fun, it's like a game. This is like, man, you got to be put you, together. So this is so what what you're doing right now is what happens in my mind when I'm watching this shit. This is why I say I like I like watching shit where I got to put it together. Yeah, I just like, man, like I get it. Right. Like it, it would be fun if I felt like I was getting it like some stuff. Right. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Like some stuff I could just put together because it's happening. But yeah, the other stuff, I'm just like, well, can I like at least get something to to. Let me get the first couple of pieces. Like, you know, when you're putting the puzzle together and it's like you got a bunch of pieces together over here, but they over here. You got Damn. a bunch of pieces together over here and you're trying to get the middle. You got to got, clump of the, clump right, of the I sky. I don't, got, <laughs> I don't got the clusters together yet. I got everything is separated. I'm just like, all right, let me see. Let's go over here. But so, look, 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 what you saying that, right? Now, what if somebody just come over your shoulder like, oh, let me put these pieces right here. This part go to this. You be ready to slap the shit out of them. That's how I feel when somebody's when somebody's breaking it down. Somebody that knows is breaking it down to me. That's yeah. kind of how I feel about it. Like, nah, let me figure the shit out on my own. Yeah, so now I, I feel you on it. I feel you trying to find it out for yourself. But that's like, I be feeling like, all right, like I'm under a time restraint. <laughs> So it's just like, all right, I have to watch this and like these small amounts of time. So it's just like, I can't, I can't study. You know what yeah. I mean? It's like, we, <laughs> I, be, I be watching movies like when I have downtime at work sometimes, you know what yeah. I mean? Or the show. So I'm just like, all right, you know what I mean? Sometimes you got to pause it to get back to whatever you was doing. Yeah. So, um. Yeah, man. It It's, um. I don't think it's, you know, sometimes it'd be like, shit ain't that deep. It might not be that deep. Yeah, but this I mean, one it but, is. But you, but yeah, it's like some things where it's just like you can really look into this and be like, oh, damn. Mm -hmm. I mean, this will take forever to really dig into, you know what I mean? And and that kind of, it makes me think about like a writer, like, you know what I mean? Like how he starts something like that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like I, I used to think Jordan Poole, like in the beginning, I'm just, I think he just throws stuff together sometime and then people put it together. So like, Jordan Peele? 
Yeah, did I say, did I say Jordan Poole or Peele? Yeah, <laughs> he said Poole. <laughs> Shout out Jordan Poole. Um, but uh, anyway, <laughs> like, well, sometimes I would think that he would just do stuff, and then it's mm-hmm. just like if people decided to, to, you know, break it down and try to decipher it, like they would make up their own theories and conspiracies about it, right? Mm-hmm. And then it would become a thing, and Jordan Poole would be just like, yeah, that was it. Okay, but it, it, it's so what you um the way the way people write stories like this is the way you write raps when you're trying to do uh double entendres. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm saying? It's, it's yeah. the same thing. It's like you know what you're doing. In yeah. your mind, you're saying it in layman terms, but when you're writing it, you like, no, nah, I'm gonna disguise it like this. And mm-hmm. only certain niggas gonna understand what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. So it's exactly what they're doing in the story, and it's exactly why I on my own want to figure it out right and for me it's like winning the game like for me it's like it's like a nigga playing madden and, and learning new jukes for me that's how I, when I, I watch certain shit it's like when i'm piecing it together that's that satisfaction of being like oh shit like oh i caught that yeah if we weren't doing the reviews i probably wouldn't try to figure it out you know what I mean? <laughs> like you know you get on you get on here to review it to to tell the our consumers, right? Yeah. What this, what this was about, you know what I mean? But we don't hear and be just like, "Hey, man, uh, <laughs> hey, but the, hey, but the, the good part is, it's probably people out there with us too, like, that. like way. man, hey, let's figure it out. <laughs> hey, let's figure it out. This is the podcast. We are gonna figure it out together. Uh, hey, <laughs> and I'm with this shit, man. Yeah. That, duh, that now I'm looking at this shit all the way more different. Like, I still, the thing is, I'm not sure about no angles. He could be dead. The 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 those couldn't those might not be his parents. Mm-hmm. That might not have been his baby. That might not even be a baby. You saw what she did with that puppet shit. That was weird as fuck. Yeah, all that shit. All, like the whole the island shit. This last episode was just like, right, it's it's starting to break off more into the fantasy mm-hmm. for me. And I'm just like, okay, like what is this? And I realize, okay, this is the wise ones, like little area these are like these are all witches or is it just one witch are there's the i mother? don't know if anybody's a witch because it's like now they're this is crazy so so this is what's crazy he saw the lady at the the at the the circle where they're discussing the trauma but then she walks past him in here kind of like <laughs> that wasn't no baby she's like wait hold, you were just having a whole breakdown mm-hmm. at yeah. the thing also why was that dude in that circle? Uh, well, no, no. Well, 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 uh, well. He, we find out he did lose his child. Mm-hmm. You talking about uh, Will Wilbert William? What's the nigga's name? Uh, William. William. I think his name was William. Yeah. Yeah. No. Okay. We did find out he lost cool. his daughter too. Yeah. But I also feel like he was the one sending those pictures. Yeah, I think so too because he's a weirdo. And, and then dude, uh, cause uh, I want to call him Liam. That's not his name. Patrice. Mm-hmm. He was like, uh, he was like, oh, you're a tech guy. He was like, oh, you're a hacker. He was like, yeah, I, uh, I do this, whatever, whatever. Mm-hmm. I feel like he was the one sending out the pictures to the wives. I feel like he has something to do with everything, but he's downplaying it like he's just a father who lost his child. It's possible because that's just well, I don't know, man. Because it's just like, how would he know when she was going to show the picture to? Apollo, because she was just like, "Yo, he just sent it to me, and it'd be gone like soon as she showed." But it, it was doing that anyways. Like she was, she'll see the picture and then it deletes. She, it was ha- it was happening like that anyway. So it wasn't oh, like no. a right before Apollo see it, it deletes. Like that was happening anyway. Because even with the uh, the lady, the lady that was like that had the picture, she was like, as soon as the picture came through, I just printed it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So had she not printed it, it was going to disappear. Right. Well, um, yeah. Um, it's funny because like even even explained right, mm. it's just telling you what you could have possibly missed, not what's happening. Like you know mm. what I mean? Like this is it. Like they're not giving you the answer. They're not giving you the answers. They're they're, yeah, they're, they're piecing they're, it together with you. They're giving you the knowledge on like the back, like the you know the little small Easter eggs in the background. Like even I think like a restaurant they went to that you probably wouldn't even think about. It's called Red Strand, like the red strand she got around her wrist. Like you wouldn't, oh, catch, you wouldn't catch that. You know what I mean? Nah. That's, something, that's something that you're not gonna pick up. Um, I don't want to do that though. I'm gonna tell a, you right now. It's a lot. I, I'm a, 
No, I'm gonna tell you why I don't want to do that. I'll do that when this when the season is over. I'll go mm-hmm. watch the explain when the season's over because I like going in with my with with just my mind. Okay, so you uh so you, you played have you ever you played Call of Duty before, right? I have, but I, I don't frequent that game like like No, no, I'm I'm games. only using that as an example. Okay. Because when you go on Call of Duty, if you play with the nigga that that's memorized Call of Duty, it's annoying because you like you walk in like I'm here for the experience. And they like it's a guy to the left. Go oh, under this. It's a guy to the right. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. No, nah, that's not my thought. Like I, I used to hate like like people just do walkthroughs. Like it was like a yeah. whole walkthrough. I was like why would I do that? Yeah. So it's, it's, <laughs> it's so so for me, I know that's not what explained by what you're telling me. That's not what explained is doing. But that's how I would feel. Right. If it wasn't for them, like, I would have like we're, I'm going to continuously miss stuff. That's the only reason why I was just like, mm-hmm. all right, I'm going to watch it and I can tell you what happened. Like, I can tell you yeah. exactly. You know how we used to recap, like from the yeah. beginning to the end. I could do that. Yeah. Step by step. What you, <laughs> I, I tell you what, but, see what I saw. <laughs> but, you you know, like like when you were talking about how when I when I'm talking to somebody, I, I hold certain shit in my mind. Like I remember something you said mm-hmm. like seven conversations ago. That's what I do when I watch these shows, too. So, like I said, they'll they'll say certain shit, and then later on, I'll be like, oh, they did say that before. So, it's yeah, like you, I'm doing – I'm putting it together myself. You retain that information. Well, I don't retain – like, well, it's not that I don't retain it. Like, I, I get it. I register it, and then it's just mm. – it's like, you know, I take a dump. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's like, like you know, it's like you, you feel like uh, – so you retain information that that means something to you. It's like right. why why do I give a fuck? I don't I don't remember that. Why would I care? Yeah. <laughs> I remember I remember I feel, like I bigger. Big, I'm gonna remember something big that I need to remember. It's like okay, I'm gonna need to remember that for the next time. But I'm probably not gonna remember remember what you told me like in a conversation like like certain things like how you remember you was just like oh man you said that you know last episode or whatever and I'm just, yeah I don't remember what you said last episode. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> I remember it, it, it's just like a tape recorder in my mind or something. It just yeah. be weird shit like that. So it's uh so my eyes be open. I'll be into the shit when I'm watching it, like trying yeah. to make sure I don't miss a damn thing. And I know I miss a lot, but I, I try to I try to catch enough to put some kind of story together in my mind. Do you think watching it with uh your wife helps? Cause like you guys are both kind of like, you know, going mm. back and forth figuring it out, or you just do that on your own anyway? I'm gonna do it regardless. Cause like even with uh she didn't so the the third episode, she was falling asleep, and oh. it's like I I expect that because she ain't she's the, she don't be invested as I be. If she, she's awake, then then we'll be we'll be talking back and forth. But other than that, she just be like, like mm-hmm. she don't give a shit. Literally, like I don't <laughs> tell me what happened next. Tell me what happened next time. Like she don't she don't care like that. But I be I be into it because it's like it's like and it's certain shit because it'll bother me i forgot what show it was and i was telling you i kept saying if they don't come back to this it's gonna piss me off because like why would you say it? i don't know what we were talking about uh, i don't even remember what show it was but they never came back around to it and it was just like well why they why they do that remember when uh, snowball but, where the little girl had the uh the beads around her, like she had the beads that said daddy on it and then it was just, she kept being in episodes but she never appeared again it was snowfall. No, it was. It wasn't even that part. It was a uh... damn. Now I don't want. I don't want to take my mind off of this. It oh, something yeah. happened. Yeah, something happened. But uh, in here, um, the fact that Patrice is scared of basements, and the fact that they highlighted that, and they don't, they don't say nothing else about it. I'm still thinking about like, why is he afraid of basements? Right. That's because I don't think that they would just like. Nothing in here is for no reason, just like you said. Yeah. You know? So anything that's said, anything that's done, location, it's like you got to peep it. You know what I mean? Like mm-hmm. even even the books that he's picking up, the books that, you know, might only be there for a second. Like I'm yeah. at this point, I'm looking at backgrounds. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, OK. And like, now and now and now you implanted it in my mind to look at shit like that, because I wasn't even thinking about the restaurant name. But yeah. now now I'm going to be looking at every like I'm now now I'm adding more to my fucking list of what to look for. Right. Yeah. How um so let's go back for a second. Um mm-hmm. when Apollo cut the strand off mm-hmm. after she came back. Cause even before even before she went, you know what I mean? Like they were just it was like, you know, they were just dating or whatever, right? Mm-hmm. Um and she leaves the airport and disappears. Did you see like when she not leave the airport, but when she's about to when he's dropping her off at the airport. She walks away, and then like Apollo, like he looked down for a second. He's like, "Where the hell did she go? Like she just disappeared in the yeah. fucking air." Yeah. Um, 
So that's what makes me think that some of this like stuff is not that he's dead, but it ain't real. Well, he said it ain't real. When that lady said, when he was like, uh, the lady was talking with the doll, and he was like, so uh, it's all an illusion. And he even was like, even Emmy. Yeah, she did because he was because he was like, well, if 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 she's not real, then all of it. uh, He was like, somebody had to make it. Somebody made it up. Mm. Which which again, damn, my mind keep doing twists and turns. Which again brings me back to the fact that I think he's dead and um, what they left you with on the fourth episode when dude was like I need you to talk to my wife talk to my wife and then he was like what if I don't he said everybody here dies and it's like what the hell you mean by that see stuff like this made me just want to just like I, I gotta go back and watch everything again but then that's just like what is that gonna do you know what I mean it's just like am I gonna catch it this time it's gonna give me some satisfaction just keep on watching the back. <laughs> just watch it backwards. <laughs> it was like you like, said, watch it backwards. Hell no, I ain't saying that. That's interesting, though. But, I mean, hey, like, it, at this point, I feel like whatever you do, uh, you know, could pick, you could pick up something. So if you watch it backwards, it's just like, oh, wait a minute. <laughs> you know what, what, does the word, what does the word changeling mean? So I don't know. I just know that it was another movie called Changeling. Um with Angelina Jolie in it and she her son was like missing like it has something to do with missing children and this is like kind of the same thing uh and then there's the book called the changeling or whatever that this guy wrote and it has something to do with uh like babies and witches but I mean the actual mm-hmm. definition uh is a child believed to have been secretly uh, substituted by fairies for their parents' real child in infancy. That's in a dictionary. Let me say that again. A child believed (laughs) to have been secretly substituted by fairies for the parents' real child in infancy. So when she kept saying, that's not a baby. It's a fairy. It's like the... They've been secretly substituted by fairies. And where is the real baby? Is there a real baby? They ate them. In that poem, they said that shit. Yeah. It's like they eat the babies or whatever. Like on some uh, Hansel and Gretel. (laughs) In that poem. It makes you you think everything knows. It's like, man, like, what is this going? where, Where is this going? too you know what i mean like what what else should i be looking for uh like as far as stuff that i already know about like stories that i already know about yeah that and and that 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 bothered me when i first heard that poem and i was telling my wife that because the poem was like the baby so innocent uh a baby's a fairy's favorite meal it was like watch outside and all of that shit yeah man that's weird that that's a real word that you can use for yeah with that definition <laughs> <laughs> it's like why why is that why is that word created like who <laughs> where did this really happen to where they was like oh yeah that, that's a changeling like wait yeah. wait what <laughs> uh, let me hear somebody say that in the hospital i'm like hey nigga you my baby nigga <laughs> stop playing <laughs> That's that's crazy, man. So I also I also thought, but that it's so much shit that I'm thinking of now. When um uh, when when she was losing it for the baby, I was like I was like they're doing a poetic way of showing uh postpartum. I thought that too. I was just like, is this supposed to be? Is she supposed to be going through that? But I think she's just possessed. Yeah. Yeah, it's like either she, I don't even want to. I don't even want to say she's possessed now. By that definition, definition, she wasn't wrong. Yeah, like it's not a real, it's not a real baby, and she was able to to see it. Um, because the wishes, her first two wishes, okay, like the you know, be married, have a healthy baby. Yeah. Um, and then that we don't know what that third wish was. Third, third wish has something to do with being like, like you know what, like what if she, like, cause they didn't give the whole dialogue with the the witch lady, right? Like when she went out there, like and she was talking, and they kind of cut that up into pieces. Like, what if she told the mm-hmm. lady she wanted to be like her, or a witch, 
like like you know what I mean whatever that lady was like hey like I will I would want to be that like you know what I mean like to have powers to do what you do it could I I I want to know I really I'm really interested in finding out what that third wish was and they keep dangling in our face and I feel like maybe they even told us without telling us. Because I remember, remember I said they they drop shit mm-hmm. like it's normal. They drop shit in normal conversation that we were supposed to just pick up on. Yeah, yeah. I got. I got. I have to. In order to get it, I feel like I'm going to have to revisit certain things that I don't understand. But mm-hmm. even in the explained, it's just like you giving me stuff that I'm like, all right, well, okay, that's that's a Greek character. Cool. All right, they this, give you. They, they give you. Book. I'm not going to read the book. That's what I'm saying. So they give you stuff that don't necessarily pertain to what we're talking about right now. They'd be mm-hmm. like, "Uh, yeah, you see that dictionary? That dictionary came out in 1978 by the Greek goddess." And the right, the, ooh, and you just be like, "Okay, so what I got to do with Apollo <laughs> um, crossing the street though? Like what? Like it's interesting, but it's just like, just like you said, like you know, getting it." on your trying to find it out on your own and really putting the pieces together. And that's like the big, you know, I guess reward of it all. Mm-hmm. Um, Cause at this point I'm thinking like, okay, like if this goes 10 episodes, you know what I mean? It's just like, I, I don't want to get it at the last minute. I do. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I want to get it, but I want to get like, okay, like, damn, I can't wait to see the next episode to see if this goes with this. You know right, I mean? but well, what just us talking about this shit right now is throwing my mind for like seven Same. or eight different loops to Same. where I now I, I now I'm anticipating the next episode. Yeah, and I, I know we're not gonna find out, you know, if that's a, a baby in the suitcase for, for, for a fact. Um, I think they're gonna. That's it. That's probably the last you're gonna see of that that scene until maybe the until end. it's time. Until it's time. I I just definitely feel like. Man, there's some weird shit going on. <laughs> I, I, I literally, like, that was the only prediction I had necessarily was that, that he was dead in that suitcase. But now, with every loop they're throwing in here, everything means something. Mm-hmm. It literally everything. And then uh, when they keep... When that lady was that lady was crying in the um in the circle, she was like, "Yeah, she told me how to get my baby back." So, which yeah, means yeah. the baby's not dead. Which means so so he's not gonna at the end of the show he's not gonna hate Emma Emmy or whatever her name is. Mm-hmm. If that baby's alive, if he's not gonna hate her. It's gonna be like you did. You, you killed mean? the fairy, right? It was dope how they did that. Uh, her possession too. Like how they filmed it backwards and then showed it forward, the way she was walking. Are oh, you talking about when they um when they told her she was alive and they showed all the pictures? No, when he was chained up and she was coming out of the oh, room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that yeah. shit was dope. Yeah. Uh, she beat the brakes off. <laughs> I thought that shit was I thought that was fake. Cause it just kind of came out of nowhere. I was just it like was random. I, yeah. But she had went and got them chains or whatever. But I didn't think that she was gonna do anything with like, I didn't think she was gonna do that. Like she had a bike rack around that nigga neck. Yeah, <laughs> you know, man. I mean, uh, she got those chains from one of the ladies, I guess. One of the um, the ladies that went through the same thing that she was going through. So they they told her how to kill the fairy. Uh-huh. Like, so what she's whatever she's doing is to get, get her baby back, right? I don't know because it's like I, I feel like she killed the baby because of what they I guess they imply you know what the uh you know she's warming up the water and you know whatever she was about to do to that baby I don't know if she was about to burn him or what mm. um she did something with that she killed the baby the baby's okay. dead okay so if the baby's dead then what baby that was the baby switched so I think from what you said uh, uh well you said you said she ate you said the fairies ate, ate the baby, and by definition, that's what, and by what that book he read, that's what I, I thought too. But right, so it's just but like that the changeling definition is just like substituted. Yeah. So you give them, you give them the fairy baby for the real baby, and they eat the fairy baby, or maybe they don't eat the baby. Even think of, even think about what the lady said when he got to that island. She was like, "Yeah, I, I'm doing a show for the kids. Like, what kids? Ain't no kids in there." Well, maybe that we've the, seen. Maybe the kids grew up, and that's what the, uh, those other people are. 
All right, man, let's stop talking about this shit. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, you know what I mean? <laughs> it could be anything. Like, man, these kids are grown now. They've been here forever. We ageless. This shit is this shit is this shit is crazy. That's why I don't like fantasy, man. I'm gonna keep it real with you, dude. I know you do. Sometimes I'll be just like, man, like, stop. Like <laughs> <laughs> give, a nigga, give a nigga a brain break, man. Like, I want to know what's happening. Stop playing. Man. <laughs> she said, she told her, yeah, she told me how to get my baby back. When she kept saying, get my baby back. And then she was like, that ba- that wasn't no baby. The one y'all had wasn't no baby. So it's man. like, she's dealt with this already. And uh, Emmy going to get those chains from her, like, this is what I guess all of these women have done. You tie up the husband. Mm-hmm. And you kill the baby, which is which is crazy. Because like, why tie up the husband? But this is some kind of ritual they have to do, right? And when the husbands come to the island, they they they've been killing the husbands. Wicker man, this nigga said wicker man. I ain't seen that yeah. in a minute. But you remember that it was like <laughs> an all woman island, and they yeah. would bring men in to sacrifice them. Yeah, that was Nicolas Cage movie, right? Yeah, Nicolas Cage. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh. Hey man, uh, give us y'all theories, man. Did we, I didn't think we was gonna do this. This is what's funny, and this is literally. I told my wife this. I said Brian don't give a fuck about this shit. What? <laughs> I told my wife this. I do though. But, you know what I mean? No, like, no, I mean like, I mean like in theory, like uh, you tested the waters by texting me and was like, yeah. Uh, so what you think about the first three episodes? Mm-hmm. I was like, he was hoping I'd be like, man, I ain't fucking with this. <laughs> I, the fucked up part about it is I know you like this kind of shit. So I was just like, when you, we, I was just making sure that we was doing it because I'm just like, yeah. right, we got a full three episodes. I ain't about to watch all these episodes if he ain't watched them. That's a fact. I was just like, all right, if he ain't watched these episodes, because I had already watched one. Yeah. And I was just like, oh, shit. And there's another one, too. I'm like, all right, shit. If he watched all the episodes, I'm like, let's do it. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's not my it's not my shit. Like, you know that? Yeah. It's not That's my what I was saying. That's shit. what I was telling her. I was like, he probably... I ain't fucking with this shit yet, but I feel like these conversations gonna make you. Uh, it, it's like it's like walking in on your wife watching some shit. You be like, man, I don't watch that shit. But then you happen to sit there long enough to get interested. That's how Harry Potter. Like, was. That was Harry Potter to me because it's like I don't no, for real. Like, I don't fuck with that shit. So it's like, but when I watched it from the jump, I think I watched mm-hmm. like the first one or the second one. First and the second one, I was just like, this shit kind of cool. I still ain't go back and watch all of them, but. I fucked I with did. what I, I fucked with what I watched, and I was just like, okay, I can see how people are like you. Just got to see certain shit from the beginning. Like, yeah, you- no. So I, I I fucked with Harry Potter from the beginning. I've seen all the seasons. Like I fucked with Harry Potter. I feel like that about um Lord of the Rings. Never seen. I was that. like, man, I don't know how y'all watching that boring ass shit. But I just happened to let me just watch it from the beginning, like you said, and I was like, okay, I get it. I, now I get it. Yeah, like the Hunger Games. I fucked with the Hunger Games heavy. Like I watched yeah. all those in the theater. Um. So it, I guess it just depends, right? Like, you know what I mean? Like, I, I can't say I hate a whole genre of, you know, I, <laughs> it's just, I, it just depends on how it's put together. I, I fuck with it. It's funny. I fuck with um Harry Potter. I fuck with shit like this. Mm-hmm. I don't fuck with Star Wars or none of that shit. No, I don't. I don't. I don't care about none of that shit. There's nothing interested about it. Niggas have been like, hey, yeah, just watch. Uh, what's that? That shit with the baby Yoda shit. They like just watch it, man. Anybody can watch it. I tried. Like, nigga, you guys lied. Get that uh, shit out of here. Yeah, anytime I see Star, I, I like Star Trek make me laugh when I see like the character. <laughs> like, this nigga got a booty on his face. <laughs> Star Trek is Star. Star Wars. Trek, Star Trek, I'm Star, Trek. Star Wars. <laughs> I know. I know characters on Star Wars. I don't know shit. I know Doctor Spock. And uh, Captain Kirk, whatever you want to call it, nigga. Yeah, uh, I know those characters, but like Star Wars, I literally just know names. I don't know nothing about nothing I, else. I watched Star Wars one time when I was little, and that was enough. <laughs> <laughs> that was enough. It, it wasn't like I don't. I'm not invested in none of that shit. People be, people be mad at me at work when I tell them I don't see certain shit. They be just, you ain't never seen Star Wars. I was like, not one <laughs> goddamn nothing. <laughs> I know nothing about it. I know the names. Yeah, because it, it don't be interesting. Living. You ain't it, living. It, 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 you ain't inter- if you ain't interested, it's hard to just force yourself to be interested. That should be so boring, man. I don't give a fuck about no Anakin, no no Walkies, no none of that shit. That, them names they be saying. I be like, man, whatever, man. Harry Potter, nigga. Have <laughs> like, you seen Juice? You seen Juice? <laughs> juice, Juice, is that? Uh, that um, Anthony, Andy Garcia in it, like nigga, no, nigga. 
<laughs> Tupac. Tupac died, though, didn't he? Like, yeah, well, he was alive at one point. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, but you know, as, man. as as for this, I I'm I could be interested and still like if you said tomorrow, like nigga, I ain't watching that, I'll be like, cool. <laughs> I was like, you're right, but then it was like I'm I will still I'll still fuck with it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Just, I ain't gonna like everything. Yeah, that's that's what I'm saying. It's it's mm. not like it's not like you like, man, fuck this all together, but it's like you can live without it. Like that's whatever. Right. Like if you stop watching it tomorrow, I was just like, oh well, shit, you know. But I'm in this shit, man. I'm in. I'm in, y'all. Uh, whoever watching this, I'm in. I'm in. Like, you in pause. Yeah, yeah. That don't do that. Uh, let me be in by myself. <laughs> 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 I'm in. I'm in. Uh, I'm interested. I'm intrigued. I'm. I'm trying to be focused. I'm damn near gonna go watch the first four episodes to see if I miss something. Hey, it's better than a shy. <sighs> Yeah, and that's coming up, guys. <laughs> if y'all tired of watching the shot, hey, jump on this. You know At least mean? these fairy tales make sense. I'd rather be confused and watch this shit than listen to that <laughs> shit. And I'm so like, hey, yo, what y'all doing over there, man? <laughs> what y'all got? Oh, my God. Hey, uh, so that was the change link. We'll be back next week for another episode because we got to go. You gotta go handle this shit. Shut uh, down. Like, hit, like, share, subscribe, talk to us. We talk back. We everywhere. If you there, uh, appreciate y'all supporting us so far, man. And tell us how y'all feel about the show. And tell us y'all theories, because you know yeah. I'm here for all the theories. But don't go read up on it and drop a theory like you was just smart enough to know that theory. Don't do that. I don't like people that do that. That go research or somebody else giving the answer to come on. Like, yeah, man. So, well, if you really think about it, nah, man, you didn't think about that. Yes, and I'm sure a lot of pages are based on like that. Like they'll go to somebody else's page and then make their own page and do the exact same thing. That's a thing. Yeah, <laughs> we don't do that over here. That's we don't thing. do that around here. Yeah, but uh, hey, man, drop anything. You know what I mean? Like, let me help me understand. <laughs> Just don't break it. If you read the book, if you know all the answers for real, don't do that though. Like, oh, yeah, let me nah. let, let us build to there. If you if you really like, if you're one of the people that read this book and know everything about the ending at least don't do that man yeah, let's i don't get... even i don't even want that at this point mm -hmm. i'm just like all right if i'm gonna figure it out i want to like i want to figure out episode by episode not like mm -hmm. oh this is the ending this is how it's gonna happen and this is what happened the baby is dead like nah don't do that yeah don't do that don't don't do that man you get blocked and i talk about your mother we know her yeah it will make your girl a change link nigga oh shit <laughs> 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 Thank you for watching. Subscribe to our YouTube and Spotify and follow us on IG and TikTok.